Hi everybody, Bloomstitch Rita here. I hope you're doing well. Let me start with that and with Happy Monday to everybody. And uh, my life is really crazy. Uh, I have no idea. I had no idea when I'm going to have a chance to to do a video, but I wanted to get it done today because I want to share with you three things today. Number one, I completed a custom journal order. And I want to ship it out today with today's mail. So I wanted to do a video about that. So I'm, I wanted to make sure I get the video done today. So this is the custom journal I will share with you. And then the other two items are, I made two more of the altered file folder and junk journal combos. Um, I think that's all I'm making for now. Uh, I made four altogether, two sold. There's, uh, and then there's these two. These two have not sold yet. Um, this one is not even listed yet. So, but this should be listed by the time this video goes up. So anyways, the two of them that are new will be listed. Let's start with that. I just finished this one today. It is, measurements will be in my eBay shop. And the link is uh, right there under right under this video to my eBay shop. So just like all my styles, this is very uh, much a mixture of grungy and vintage. Lots of coffee dyed fabrics, laces, paper, lots of crunchiness, and lots of uneven messiness. You know, I'm not an exact crafter as you know it. I don't measure. I do not do straight things as far as straight lines. Um, so that's that's what it is. I absolutely love this messy vision of Victorian era. Yumminess is what I call it. So this is our cover. Again, the measurements are in my eBay shop. And lots going on here. This is actually a collage of different laces and appliques. And this is a... Um, uh, corset yes thank you and then it opens up like this on this side it's an envelope with goodies in there I'm not gonna take the goodies out those will be surprises little collage here I mix mix fabrics and paper and you know laces and appliques abundantly in my creations on this side we have this cute little collage with this beautiful lady in a ball gown big ruffle I love my ruffles and then it opens up it's hard to get it all in here I, I apologize I try my best here big big uh, seam binding ribbon here this is a window envelope that opens up and then look at this applique it's gorgeous it's a huge applique running down all the way from the top to the bottom it was snow white I coffee dyed it there's a sorry silk ribbon on top of it. And then this part right here is just a big pocket is all it is with all kinds of yummy goodiness, have, um, um, heavily coffee dyed items, handmade items. There are tags, there are the uh, notepads, there are vintage postcards, journaling cards, all kinds of goodies in here that I'm not going to take out. It is for whoever gets it to discover. This is a lot to discover in here. Look at this applique. I love it. This is just gorgeous. And then here's the journal. It is a full size journal in here. I think there's just 36 pages in here front to back. All blank, all crunchy and coffee dyed for you to fill it up. And then on this side, we have this big pocket, collaged pocket that opens up. There's goodies in the big part here, in this gusseted bag. And then there's a little bag on top of it with goodies. Oh, I, I want to show you one of them because it is, I think it's really cute. It's just a mini, a mini little scrappy note pad that I sewn together. It's a mini blank little journal. Just so cute. It goes right in there. And there's a, this tag is in there too. But anyways, there's other stuff in here too. Um, and then here we have another, uh, yeah, it's an altered envelope. It's a window envelope that 
I have this beautiful lace on the bottom here, just beautiful. This is a snippet that I hand sewn, and then I glued that in here. Beautiful applique. Oh, I don't know if you can see this, it's just gorgeous. And this folds down, and this is just some beautiful uh, golden lace. And then this is a um, altered the CD envelope with this picture of a beautiful lady in there and the lifts up. And then in here we have a scrappy notepad for extra writing with another beautiful uh, 3D applique here. Yes, oops, I need to cut that open there, which I will do that. So it folds down, it folds up, folds in and then this is the back with a cute little envelope with goodies in here for you with a cute little ribbon on it so yeah this one folds in and that folds on top and it comes with this separate item it's a little trifold with a scrappy notepad in the middle and then goodies on either side tucked in here in this corner tuck spots Yes, so that is a set. And then another one. This is my second altered fire folder slash junk journal combos. And these two, like I said, are available. These two sets, the one I just showed you is available and this is available. And these are the last two that I'm doing for a while. Um, I love doing them, but I have so many other things that I want to do. My list is just, it just keeps growing. Uh, yeah. <laughs> so anyway, measurements will be in my eBay shop. Or actually, they are already there. This is listed already. Uh, again, this is a corset with a collage. I think it's just gorgeous. I mean, there's so much going on. I'll just let you look at it because... You have to actually see this in person and experience it and see the laces and the layering, this 3D applique. And so this one opens up. We have a pocket here. And this is your front cover. Again, these are really hard to film. And then we open this up into the main section. On this side we have a lift up and this folds out. Look at this applique. This was also Snow White. I coffee dyed it. So this is a pocket. And I forgot to put something in there. I will put several things in there. That will be a surprise. Now we have a big, big pocket here in the middle. And with all kinds of goodies from just like the others. I mean, totally different things. But scrappy notepads, altered um, envelopes, tags vintage postcards uh just all kinds of ephemera for you to use cute little oh my gosh cute little tags everything for you to use and then look at this sparkly butterfly that is the cover for the cover of your journal the blank pages coffee dyed crunchy crunchy paper we have a little rosette here on a safety pin that i just put on this cute little ribbon so this is your journal right here. And then on this side, let's see if I can move this. We have a barroom uh, picture. And this huge, huge coffee dyed lace piece that folds down, folds down. And it is an envelope with some applique on here. And it has goodies inside it. I'm not gonna take them out, it's a surprise. We have a big envelope right here with a corset or a dress form and this cute little fuzzy flower and a big ribbon. The envelope has goodies tucked in here. And then it opens up. This is from a wedding dress right here, an applique. And look at this golden, beautiful golden applique I have. This is an altered, um, seriously altered CD envelope here. I, multiple different methods I use from embossing, inking, collaging, and it just lifts up. And then here's another big applique in here. So this folds in, well, this one folds in first, 
this one folds on top of that and then here is the back look at this cute little envelope i just love it it lifts up and then you have, there are goodies in here for you and it just folds down so yes i make sure to put stuff in this envelope and this altered fire folder slash junk journal combo comes with this beauty this is an altered envelope cardstock envelope it has goodies in there a few things for you and you can use it for anything to store anything from receipts to coupons uh your own ephemera whatever this is some really yummy fluffiness going on here and a little collage with this lady and a bow so that's the two sets that i have available called uh, altered fire folder and junk journal combos and now to the main attraction this is a custom order custom journal order for miss a for miss a i have created this was not actually included in the purchase i created this as a gift this quilted cover that ties around the journal this will be a little gift just a little extra and then here's our journal now miss a wanted birds vintage birds and bright greens so kind of a springy uh journal so vintage bird bright greens pinks and yellows and um more writing space let me tell you miss a i had a really hard time not filling in the pages it's a lot harder for me to leave the pages blank than it is to fill them up but i tried my best i actually included extra writing paper in here extra pages blank pages for you uh, i know it is a gift and uh, i hope that you will truly enjoy it so if you don't if you want to be surprised then don't watch but here is i'm not going to show everything but here is a quick flip through of the journal uh, this is some just beautiful um, tablecloth that I coffee dyed. And here is our cover. I just love that image. The pink flowers in the background with this beautiful bird. Just beautiful, I think. And so springy. And there's a lot going on here for you to discover. Fluffy flower. And then big pocket here. I'm not going to take the goodies out. I'll let you discover them. More writing paper in here too. And then here's a vintage birdie with a bow. Writing room. All the papers are coffee dyed because Miss A likes the vintage look. So I left them like that. Coffee dyed. Lifts up. Ooh, collages. So I did a lot of the just the edges, you know, decorating the edges. Since I tried to leave room for writing as it was requested. And there's goodies in this pocket. The charm more room for writing this lifts up lots of room for writing there this little bird cage just clips in there this one says i think it might be a tim holtz uh, let your beautiful soul shine and a little pocket here with goodies a little collage with this owl and this beautiful embroidered uh, applique Scrappy note, had more room for writing. This is, uh, I hand sewn these uh, petals. I actually created the petals myself. I cut the fabric out into circles and I singed them individually. In the, I singed the petals individually over fire by holding it with a tweezer. I hold these uh, with a tweezer over, over candle fire until they curl up on the outside. So individually curled up the oops <laughs> lost my tweezer anyways these petals that's how i make them i think i did yeah i did a video about them a uh, long time ago this one lifts up this one lifts out and i do have little messages a little stamping stem messages in there here and there one of my other little handmade flowers pocket beautiful um this is from a, a table runner i cut out this uh beautiful purple flower and sewed it in here for pocket and look at this little birdie this is a tea bag and i made it into a pocket 
little pocket here, pocket there, lift up, beautiful bow. I love my bows and I love my ruffles. And here is an envelope that has goodies in there, folds out. Extra writing space. This one folds out for extra writing space. Big pocket here with all kinds of goodies that will be for you to discover. So that is the custom order for Miss A. I hope you will love it. I will be shipping it out this evening. So thank you again so much, everybody. Those two altered file folder junk journal combos are listed. And I'm not sure exactly what I'm doing next because I have so much, <laughs> so many things on my list. But I hope we'll be, we'll be back later this week. So you guys have a great rest of the week and peace out.